everyone. Um, just wanted to do a quick haul. Um, I've gotten some things recently, things that I'm currently wearing, and my glasses are being said to the other time I don't wear my hair glasses. Um, so yeah, this is a little bit different. Sorry, I have like my hair up kind of like lazy today. Um, I have one quick outfit of the day for you guys. Um, it's this top, it's orange, it's not really picking up on camera, but it's like a sheer blouse, um, since that's really in for the summer, I decided to get one before summer even began, it was like around spring, I believe, yeah, anyways, so, um, I got this at Nordstrom, it was, mm, I had the tag for it, I believe it was around 30 bucks, don't quote me on that, might have been a little bit more, I think Nordstrom, um, not Nordstrom Rack, but regular Nordstrom is usually a little bit more expensive. Um, and then I got these shorts, which are these, like, I guess, floral print shorts that are really in as well. Um, I don't know if you guys can see that, I don't know if it's picking up on camera or not. Okay, well anyways, and then I just have on, um, my coach, oh this is awesome, my coach suits, <laughs> that my boyfriend gave me, which if he's watching this, thank you. Anyways, so, um, trying to make this as quick as possible because I don't want to bore you guys to because I have a lot of things, but, alright, here we go. Starting off with where I work, I work at Victoria's Secret, as many of you know. Um, so I got two, obviously two sports bras, something that's not too awkward to be showing, but I've seen a lot of, um, beauty gurus show this in the past, so I mean, shouldn't really be all that weird. Um, sorry guys, I'm pretty, anyways, um, this is it, this is the VSX, um, sports bra. It's a little bit too, a couple sizes too small for me, but it was on sale for, um, 30 bucks, I believe. Um, most of the bras that are like this, which don't have a cup, it's just like a regular medium, low to medium coverage, I would say. Um, since it doesn't have the cups in it, um, it's usually nineteen ninety nine, which is pretty cheap, and it was uh, on our standby annual sale. Normally, these would be a, a lot more. It'd be like forty bucks or maybe more for just this one. So that was kind of a steal, and I don't get my um, work bonus on top of this, so it's kind of like a disadvantage. But it was still pretty good pricing. Um. Alright, on to some clothes that I got, um, on the Schaefer end. These were from JCPenney, and most of them still have the tag on it, actually. All of them, except for the ones that I'm wearing, shirts that I'm wearing, still all have the tags on it. Um, I bought it recently, so I can go ahead and tell you guys the price. Alright, starting with this mint green, which I... As you've all seen, it's really in for spring and summer. I'm not sure if it's picking up, but it's very, very bright. Um, and it's lacy also, which is also in. And I picked in a size small, just because I'm kind of on the short end, so things tend to be a little bit longer on me than on someone that's obviously average to tall height. Um, but I got this for literally. 13 bucks at JC Penny. Yeah. Sorry if my nails look horrible. I haven't done them in like a week, which is surprising because they're still pretty intact. <laughs> and then, besides the shorts that I have on, I got two more shorts because I was in great need of some shorts. And I have a few, but they're from Brazil, and they're a little bit, um, I guess, 
harder to wear here because of the style. They're just a little bit different right now. Um, but anywho, these are the shorts that I got. The back has little panties on it. Um, if anyone's wondering, I'm size, well, the ones that I'm wearing right now are size one, but they're, I think, a little bit bigger than usual. Usually I'm about size two or three. I couldn't find size two there. Usually they only have like the odd numbers. Some stores carry the even numbers, like Air Postal, I know does. So it just really depends. Um, I guess from one to three, just how I wear it, I guess, if any one of you guys were wondering. Um, and then I got this really shiny skirt. It's like a pencil skirt with a white puff in um, your shirt, and then still looks very cute. Oh, which by the way, I forgot to tell the price on those shorts. this like big thing that it was in. It was probably about $17 because as I can see on this next one, which I guess I'll just show it to you. I'll show the skirt after again. It has a belt. It's the first shorts that I think I've ever bought and it has a belt. I know my boyfriend, all his shorts pretty much come with belts and I'm like, oh, that's actually a good idea. <laughs> anyway, so are pretty cute. Um, the back is just very more plain than the other one. This one is more plain in general, which is good because it goes with probably a lot more tops. And this again, I got in a size three, and it was 17 bucks. So I'm guessing the other ones were probably 15 since it didn't come with a belt. And then the skirt was literally a steal. Yes, it was 10 bucks, and I got in a medium. The small was all out, or else I would have gotten the small, but I thought this was such a steal, and such a cool fabric and material and color that I just loved it. Anyway, and then besides that, lately, talking about less fashion, more beauty-related makeups, um, I recently got the Bare Minerals a little kit that goes like this to my skin tone and um my skin tone is fairly light and tan if you guys were wondering um yeah hopefully I'll be getting a little bit of a darker shade um this summer I'm Brazilian fairly light is like wow really um comes with the brushes and everything the kit so it was I think around 45 bucks and it was because my friend works here I think normally it's like 50 or 60 I don't know um I can ask her if, you, if any of you are wondering so leave in the comments below if you have any questions um I got in the matte one which my skin type is like oily to mixed combination skin so thought matte for the summer might be a lot better I just put on very lightly I didn't put on a lot at all before filming, so this works pretty well. Um, I have some sunscreen, SPF 15, I see, so it's perfect. And then, on that note, talking about skin, I've also, in the past, um, I would say three, four months maybe, got Retin-A. Now, this is the secret to me using Retin-A, it's made my skin a lot better. I had a lot of breakouts, especially on this side of my cheeks. I think I might have showed in my January video, it was a lot worse. Um, so I kind of, I would say this is my secret product, really, but um, check in the mirror, Rachel, um, I'll link her down below. I watch her a lot and I absolutely love Rachel so she's watching this. Hi. 
Um, absolutely love her, and she recommended Retin-A, and she was the reason why I actually went to my gynecologist and my doctors and talked to all of them before I started using Retin-A, um, which you, you can only get from your doctor. And ba basically all it does is it makes your skin peel a little bit faster than it is usual, and it takes all the, if you exfoliate properly, it takes all the dead skin cells off a lot faster, so baby, basically you get baby skin. That's yeah, so basically you get baby skin. Um, eventually, you do break out a little tiny bit in the beginning, I feel like. Um, I've heard that with a lot of people, but it goes away. Um, your skin starts to look more white, more flawless, more evened out. Um, so yeah, that's it. I'm not going to make this video any longer because it's already like 11 minutes. So I guess I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.